Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be either a tutorial or to check get ready with me. I have not yet decided. Um, I also have not decided what I'm doing for my eyes. Which is rare. Yeah, I'm not feeling this. Sorry. I think I might go old school with soft glam. I have not used this palette in a long, long time. Yeah, this is kind of what I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Um, I wanted to do my eyes first this time around compared to the base. Um, because I... So I'm going to be using two different concealers, and I'm sorry for that, but you don't need to use two different concealers. You just can use whatever you have but I use um, my concealer as primer and I'm gonna take my nose ring out because we all know how forgetful I am I literally forget that I have a nose ring until like I'm done with a look or something right also my hair looks crazy I apologize for that um, curly hair problems it's day two hair and but I like am just so over like primers for eyes. I just use concealer. Um, I learned this tip from Jaclyn Hill and it has worked for me. Um, and plus I think a concealer or a paint pot um, does a good job of covering the veins and the whatnot for your eye look. Um, you guys wonder what I had for breakfast today? I had cold pizza and breadsticks from Pizza Hut. So basically, I was not in a mood to cook and neither is my mommy. So we ordered out. I got Taco Bell instead. Okay. This is a big debate, but I need to know if you guys like pineapple on your pizza or you don't like pineapple on your pizza. I don't like pineapple on my pizza. My mom does not like pineapple on her pizza, except my dad loves it. So, settle it down in the comments below for me, guys, because it's a, it's a debate. It's a real debate. So, anyways, <laughs> I'm going in with Soft Glam. And I'm going to go in with the shade Burnt Orange. I'm going to mix it with Sienna. I'm going to tap the excess. And I'm going to go in. I went in with my E45 Blender Brush. So I go back and forth, back and forth. And then I buff in circular motions. I want like a... So one of my favorite fall looks to wear is this like like purple rustic kind of cranberry-ish esque thing um and it just I don't know you guys like with my skin tone and everything it um works super well like whoopsies Hello, this is a new shirt, thank you. I am wearing a Kittness shirt today. Um, it is semi-cropped. Can't really tell, but it is semi-cropped. And yes, creaky chair makes an appearance. I swear, you guys, I do not, I don't have like gas or anything. I'm, I promise you, it's literally, that's creaky chair. So. And with looks like this that are kind of concentrated, I would say always have like a clean like riffraff brush. So this is like the Kylie brush that I got from when I got her peach palette or whatever the hell palette it was, but it was that peach thing. Um, and now, okay, so now I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna go in extremely slowly. This is a E35. I'm gonna go in with the shade Mulberry, which is 
this shade right here. It is a rich wine shade and I'm gonna go in slowly. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pat it here and I'm also gonna pat it here because the pigment is super concentrated. Like that will take me a very long way. And then I'm just going to blend. But I'm gonna keep it mostly concentrated here. And I'm gonna blend, 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 blend. Um and you guys can see that. I would love to have my camera on this side when I do my eyeshadow. But I'm so messy, and I'm embarrassed of showing you how messy I am, that I just put it on this side. Because I'm not dirty, but I am messy. And it's just so annoying sometimes, like, when I have to clean my room. But... You know, it's when you do Chit Chat Get Ready With Me's, you see literally how much time you spend on your makeup. <laughs> like, I don't even notice it because, like, when I used to do Instagram stuff, right? Like, I had to hurry up because I had a 15-minute time limit. And um, I'm going to dip into this shade, Sultry, right here. Show them properly. The shade is sultry. I'm not calling the shade sultry. The shade's name is sultry. So. And now I'm going to tug. You do not want to tug. Do as I say, not as I do. Because it will cause wrinkles this is not picking up properly with the brush i don't like the way it looks with the brush i'm gonna go in with my finger okay much better this is like a rich eggplant color but it's got that pinky undertone and i don't know if you guys can tell but it makes like brown eyes like pop like I can see a visible difference in person. Um, and not that I'm gonna do this today, but if you wanted to like amp this look up by a really like high factor, like clubbing kind of, so now I'm done with that. And I'm not going to go back in and blend. All I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this and I'm just going to buff it so there's no hush lines. Um, because that pigment will, you know, the pigment will kind of crease up if you do not take this extra step and blend. Um, you can go back in with like your original brush that you used with your transition colors. But I wouldn't recommend that. I would just go with a clean brush. Now I'm going to take this. I'm going to wipe. And I'm going to do my eyeliner later. But if you guys... Let me see if I still have that color. I'm pretty sure I did. No. Okay. Sorry. This color over here is extremely similar to what I'm wearing on my eyelids. If I was going for a look where I just, I wanted that extra oomph factor, I would definitely go underneath with that. And then I would go in with the shade Sultry in the Soft Glam palette. And then I would um, top it off with something else. But that is more of a clubbing look that is not a run in the day, um, your everyday kind of look. That's not what it's for. 
it's for you have a night out and you wanna show up and show out, yeah? Um, I'm going to do the contour. Fenty matchstick in the shade Truffle. And I go in with my angled contour brush. Again, please excuse like my hair. It, for those of you who have curly hair, please leave me any suggestions because my dad has curly hair, but he's a guy. So he doesn't need to do much for it because it pretty much stays concentrated on his head. My mom has straight hair. She can't help me. Not with my pain. But, here, let me put it out. She don't know. But if you have curly hair, please let me know what you do to maintain it. Because it is difficult. It is so, what the? Uh, a day, I should do a day in the life of me filming. Um, good news, study with me's will be starting this week. I'm gonna do time lapses. I am going in with a rare beauty foundation, you guys. I just, I love it. I go in on my nose. And the reason for that is because my nose is the most annoying part of doing my foundation. I'm gonna go with the butt end of the beauty blender. But so and blend, blend, blend. It looks like skin, you guys. It doesn't irritate my skin. Um, this is a hormonal breakout. And I just, I have the Maria Badescu drying lotion and I've been putting that on and I do mask pretty frequently. So, and honestly, it'll leave when it leaves. I'm not too worried about it. Um, it's probably telling me I need to, which is anyway, I think I need to do, but like wash my sheets and my pillows and all that, so. Again, I'm not too, too worried about it. Now with this kind of a look, you want to do that highlight because if you notice right now, everything is like super dark on me in the sense of the con the darkness is kind of taking over. We want to bring some light and warmth to the face. So with that being said, I'm going to go in with KKW Beauty Concealer in the shade 6. And you guys know that that is more than enough. Um, I don't draw the triangle. I stamp it out and then I blend upward because that I find is the best way to, and you wanna, women, we are, and women and men who are wearing makeup, we always forget that there's the inner corner that is the area where a lot of darkness collects please 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 for the love of god and all is almighty do not do not forget to go to your inner corners and like look how much it brightened it up do you see that like I'm just going to take whatever part is wet. I waited a little bit too long for my beauty blender, but it's okay. We make it work. So. Press it in, concentrate it, push it up, do whatever you need to. So. That is it with the liquids. I'm gonna go in with eyeliner. I'm just gonna go in with this, you guys. I was gonna, I was like gonna grab my liquid eyeliner, and then I realized I don't have any. 
And this I am throwing out because you, sir, are annoying. Thank you. Next. But, um, what was it this one or was it the other one? I'm so, you guys, I'm legit so effing bad with just washing my brushes. To me, it is the most boring job. I will literally clean my entire garage. I have no problem with cleaning my entire garage. I actually quite thoroughly enjoy doing that. You, I cannot be bothered for whatever reason it is to clean my makeup brushes. I've complained about this so many times, but I'll do a video on how I clean my brushes. I deep clean them pretty much maybe once a month, a month and a half, which I know you guys are seeing these tutorials being pumped out like in quite a rapid fashion. That's because I pre-film my videos and post them beforehand. Doing my eyeliner. Um, because You never know what's going to happen and I never want you guys to feel like there's no schedule for my videos. When I do have one. Okay, and I'm not gonna curl my lashes today, you guys. I don't feel like it, so I'm not going to. Um, but I like, I don't think my dad called me. He will text me if he calls me. Oh, this is like a weird thing, and I don't know if your families do this, but in my family, I don't get called by my actual name. It's a nickname. So when I get called by my real name, I'm like, my first, literally the first thing I say is, what did I do wrong? I can't be the only one that has that reaction. And this is what I mean by the the lashes hold well. You'll see why in like the favorites video that I do because I the September favorites will go up. Um, 
by the time I by the time you guys see this video, the September favorites video will have already ha um, been up. Why is there wind? We are not in Chicago. At least I'm not. But. I'm like so satisfied with this purchase, you guys. Also, um, please let me know if you guys want to see, like, a perfume favorites or something. Um, basically what had happened was I had a blackout moment and thought that, um, okay, Lolita. I'm gonna go in with classic I gone to after this dries down but basically I had a blackout moment on Kim Kardashian's um, fragrance site and I got six of so I have big girl perfumes now as I like to refer to them as and because I never had a big girl perfume before I would always borrow my mom's and um, you know what, I'm not even gonna contour, I'm just gonna do blush and a little bit of highlight. Cause I, I'm just gonna forehead, con like not even contour, sorry, bronze. But um, is it, my forehead will look weird if I don't do that. But I'm gonna go in with that. And I basically got what I like to call big girl scents from like actual perfumes from her website and my favorite so far is like body three like i don't like the packaging of it i'm gonna be honest with you i think it's really awkward but this is what body three looks like like i don't i'm sorry i don't know about you guys i don't really care to hold kim kardashian whenever i like i don't know spritz myself with perfume to me, it doesn't make much sense, but I get why, because it's it's quite like eye-catching, so it's a good marketing thing. It's like, oh, I'm gonna go with NARS Albatross. You will see NARS Albatross around a lot more now that it's fall, because I particularly like wearing this highlight in the fall. It just does something that in the summer, I feel like in the summer it's a bit too much, and in the fall, it does a really good, really, really good job of it doing its job. Uh, I really like it, you guys. So. Okay. Classic icon to... It looks way neuter 
on camera, but I promise you it's just fine in person. I don't know why it's picking up that way, but it looks just fine. Um, and if I don't like it, I'll, I will, that's not what I need. I will just, um, okay, I guess we are contouring. Going with NARS um, Casino. I don't have enough products for, to do one brand um, makeup tutorials, you guys. Like, I have not gone out and exclusively purchased everything that a line owns. Um, one, I don't know where to store it, so I didn't do that. But I would love to, after I gain a little bit of more of a following, to do that for you guys. And, I don't know, kind of bring that onto my, okay. I'm going to close this video out because somewhere, somehow, my nose ring is missing. And before you guys see me panicking, um, I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you guys like this one. Until then, stay safe and be healthy. Love you guys. Bye.